Hey guys, Happy Trees here, and in today's video, we're going to be getting a little gameplay with the Hydra. I figured I'd do a video on this because you can still pick it up in the event store for a very reasonable 840 gold. So, if you haven't picked it up already, you might as well pick it up. So, I'll just give my opinions on it now. I think it's okay. It's a pretty average assault rifle. Um, maybe slightly better than average, but... It's alright, there's definitely de better options out there, but this is okay. It's a slower firing, it has a really short magazine clip, which is a downside for sure. It has a slow fire rate, but the range is okay, it's pretty decent. And yeah, it's just one of those weapons that instead of like a regular assault rifle that you shoot a bunch of bullets and do a bunch of damage that way, this is kind of more, the accuracy really matters with this. One bullet does a good bit of damage. So I'll just quickly compare it here with the Siege Breaker, which is a very common weapon. You can get it out of pinatas. Uh, but yeah, see here, the DPS is almost the same. But there's a big difference. This damage is per shot, per bullet. So we're doing way more with the Hydra. Uh, it has a way slower fire rate. And the magazine size is it's probably its biggest downfall. So I just wanted to compare the Hydra with the Tiger also. Because in the gameplay I'm going to be using the Tiger to kind of show off the difference in damage that can be done. But here you see the DPS is, is way lower. It's also Obsidian versus Shadow Shard, which Obsidian is less damage. Less impact also. But uh, I just wanted to compare the perks really. So... I have a, a slightly more upgraded, but not too much. It's not going to make a huge amount of difference. So I should also point out, before we get started here, you might see, in the course of the gameplay, me shooting really fast. But this is the normal fire rate. And because I'm playing Urban Assault, if you get a headshot, the fire rate increases a lot. So just in case you were confused by that, that's what that is. So yeah, decent range on this thing, which makes it alright. That's always good to have good range. Alright, let's try it out on the smasher here. Reload, of course. Ah, oh, we got somebody helping us out. See that reload? That's another reason why I really don't like it too much. You're always constantly reloading. So yeah, if you're going to be playing this weapon, I would highly recommend using it on Urban Assault. I think uh, the new soldier, the one-shot Rio, I think, uh, might be a good option too. Because this guy's going to get bonuses for... Reload and also the uh, the fire rate, so it makes it pretty good with him, or better at least. All right, let's test this out on some blasters. See how many shots it takes to interrupt their eye blast. One. Oh, that was quick. Let's try again. One, two, three. Three shots. I think that first one I just got a little lucky. But now let's compare it with the Tiger. It's way faster, I can just tell you already. See that? Really fast. Interrupt. And that's kind of the main problem, the main issue I have with the Hydra. Just that interrupt. Because you really need it a lot of the time. And, uh, yeah, just because of the slow fire rate, it really hurts you. Alright, here's some more blasters to check it out. One, two, three. Four. Four shots! And now let's compare that to the Tiger. Way faster, see? Just because of the slow rate of fire. Let's reset it again. Shoot at me. Come on, you can do it. One, two, three. That one did it on three, so that's better. 
But if you miss one bullet in that, it really, really slows things down. So that's kind of why I'm not a huge fan of this. Just because of the blaster, the blaster issue. You can knock them down way faster with, with other assault rifles. So let's see how fast we can knock these guys down. Come on, fire. All right, so that wasn't bad. But that's because I had my increased rate of fire going on. And that's an urban assault perk. The reload, you'll get you'll get used to that, the reloading. Happens all the time. And three clips. No. So yeah, I suppose if the rate of fire thing is going on, uh, which is an urban assault perk, you can knock them down pretty quick. There were three right there, and it didn't even get him. But that was a long range, too, so... I guess we have to take that in account. Get back! Get out of here! So yeah, it does okay damage. And, uh, so I guess we can just quickly compare it to this guy. This is my Obsidian Tiger, which has, uh, about the same amount of perks put into it. I don't have this thing too leveled up. And this thing has better range, also. So pretty much, the, the better the range, the less damage you're gonna do. Kinda, sorta. It's pretty much how it usually works out. So yeah, that's just a lot better damage right there. I mean, we were at farther range. And it, it took him down that much quicker. Try it out on this guy. Oh, there he goes. Yeah, way, way better on just the tiger. Uh, I don't know, that's why I don't care too much for this gun and that tiger is obsidian too so that's that means less damage yeah way faster way more damage Alright, and now here's one all by himself. Get away from the tree. Come on! Get out of there. Yeah, so, I don't know. There's definitely better options out there, but... So yeah, that's the Hydra. Um, it's an alright weapon. There's definitely better options out there. But, if you're newer to the game and... and are kind of short on good weapons, it's definitely worth picking up, especially for 840 seasonal gold that's very affordable and uh they'll do all right also even though this isn't my one of my favorite assault rifles i do use it quite often and that's just because it uses shotgun ammo so that's very nice if, if you're having issues with running out of ammo and you're having to craft some uh it's very nice to put this gun in the mix you can use some of uh, your shotgun shells up and you won't have to be crafting ammo and wasting your materials on that you can use them for traps instead but yeah that's uh that's the hydra uh i hope you enjoyed and i'll catch you guys next time bye